In the heart of the wilderness, she was alone, or so she thought. Lost in the rocks, she faces challenges beyond her imagination. But even in the darkest moments, there's a glimmer of hope. Her journey isn't over, but she's stronger than ever before. How to bring your AI characters to life with flawless consistency. In this video, we're diving deep into the secrets of creating AI movies where every character remains true to their unique traits from start to finish. If you're passionate about AI and filmmaking, this one's for you from the thumbnail. You've probably guessed the topic of today's video. After uploading an AI movie trailer with consistent characters on my channel, I received many comments asking for a tutorial. I'll show you step by step how to create your own AI movie with consistent characters, even using your own face. Learn how to turn character images into a seamless video. Watch till the end to ensure you don't miss a single step. Let's make your movie magic happen. To begin generating the script for our AI movie, we'll start with ChatGPT. In this prompt, we'll input the details required to create the script. You can find this prompt in the video description for easy access. For this particular movie, I'm focusing on a female character. The settings and specific details about our character are outlined below, and we'll use these to guide the script generation process. Since we're making a movie featuring a female character, I've specified a man realistic cinematic under species for this prompt. Similarly, for the video style, I've written realistic cinematic below. If you prefer to create an animated video, you can change the species to a woman 3D Pixar style, and in the video style section, you can write 3D Pixar style. It's important not to alter the other settings in this prompt. Now, if your script includes more than one character, simply copy the settings for the first character and paste them below. Then, modify the species to define the new character. Let's say our second character is a man. In that case, we will change the setting from woman to man, but all the other settings will remain the same. Next, we'll copy this prompt and head over to ChatGPT. Paste it into the text box and click Send. Once you do that, ChatGPT will generate and provide the script for our movie trailer. Here, I've generated the script for the movie trailer. Generating the full script for the entire movie would make the video too long, so we're starting with the trailer. ChatGPT has provided all the character details for each scene and even included prompts for generating the images, making the process much easier and more organized. However, if we create the images using the prompts generated by ChatGPT, they won't feature consistent characters. To ensure consistency in the characters, we need to give ChatGPT a different command. To do this, we'll return to our Google Doc prompt page. You can find this specific prompt in the video description as well, so make sure to check it out. Now, we need to fill in all the details about the character that ChatGPT has provided. This includes the character's name, age, species, appearance, expressions, clothing, and any other relevant information. All of this information has already been generated by ChatGPT in the previous steps, so we just need to copy and paste it into the appropriate fields here. Now, we'll go back to ChatGPT. After copying the character details, we need to paste this image prompt information in front of the corresponding scene. Copy the details from the Google Doc with all the information and paste it into ChatGPT. Then, click Generate. Once you do that, ChatGPT will give us the prompt to generate the image according to the first scene of our movie trailer. Now here's where the real fun begins. With our script in hand, it's time to bring our characters and scenes to life visually. To do that, we'll use Piclumen, a powerful AI tool designed to generate cinematic quality images. Piclumen will help us take the descriptions from our script and turn them into stunning visuals. This ensures that each scene looks as vivid and captivating as the story we've written, by inputting the image prompts for every scene, Piclumen will bring the world of our film to life, making it immersive and dynamic for the audience. Now, let's head over to Piclumen, one of the easiest and most user-friendly AI tools available. After signing up, click on the Create button, and you'll be taken to an interface like this. First, select the Flux model. Then, adjust the image resolution to 16:9 to match the typical video aspect ratio. Next, Choose how many images you want to generate for this scene. Now, I'll copy the first image prompt from our script and paste it into the Piclumen image search box. After that, simply hit Generate. In just a few seconds, Piclumen will generate four images for us. I'll review the options and select the one that best fits the scene, then save it to a folder on my device for later use. Now, it's time to generate the image for the second scene. To do this, we'll go back to the Google Doc. Remember, 
The only thing we need to change or replace is the yellow highlighted text. We'll copy the new information from ChatGPT and paste it into each yellow highlighted section, one by one. This way, we can ensure that each scene gets the correct details for the next image generation. Now, we'll copy the updated information from Google Docs and paste it into the respective yellow highlighted areas for the second scene. After that, copy the image prompt for the second scene and paste it into the yellow highlighted text in Google Docs. Next, copy all the information and paste it into ChatGPT, then press Enter ChatGPT will now generate the prompt for the second scene. We can then copy that prompt and paste it into Piclumen. Once you click Generate, Piclumen will create the images for the second scene. Afterward, you'll see the consistency of your character across the images. Choose the one that fits best and download it. For the third scene, repeat the process by copying the information from ChatGPT, pasting it into the Google Doc, and clicking Send to get the third scene's prompt. Once received, paste the prompt into Piclumen and click Generate. You'll now have the images for the third scene as well. Download the image you like, just as you did with the previous ones. Now, we need to generate images for all the scenes. Once we have those, we can move on to swapping faces in the images. For this, we'll be using AIEs, a free tool that allows unlimited face swaps. Not only can you swap faces, but you'll also get many other features with this tool. If you're interested in learning more, let me know in the comments, and I'll create a detailed video on how to use it. In fact, I've already made several videos on face swapping, and you can check out the face swap playlist after watching this video. You'll also find the link to this tool in the video description. Simply click on it, and it will take you to the page. From there, click on Try Free AI Face Swap, and then you'll need to create an account to get started. After creating your account, an interface like this will appear. You'll see two options here. If your image contains just one character and you want to swap only one face, you'll select the first option. If your image has more than one character and you need to swap multiple faces, you'll select the second option. Since we are working with an image that has only one character whose face needs to be changed, we'll go with the first option. Now, in the first option, you'll need to upload the face you want to replace the character's face with. Simply upload your image here, and we'll move on to the next step. Now, we'll click on Upload to upload your own photo. After that, we'll upload the AI image we generated using the new Flux Ultra Raw model. If you're not sure how to generate that, you can check out the video linked after this one. If you want to use your own face in the movie, just select your own photo for the upload. In the second option, we need to upload the image of the character whose face we want to swap. Click on Upload and select the AI-generated image for this. Once both images are uploaded, click on Face Swap below. After a few seconds of processing, the AI will apply the new face to the character. When it's ready, click on Download to save the updated image. Now we'll upload the second image. Just like before, select the same AI girl photo and upload the second image we created using Piclumen. Repeat the face swap process for all the images you've generated, and download the final images after each face swap. Once we have all the images, it's time to convert them into a video. For this, we'll use Minimax Halio AI. You can find the link to it in the video description. Simply click on the link, and we'll move on to the next step of turning these images into a cinematic video. After clicking the link, you'll be directed to this page. This tool is in Chinese, so when you first open it, you may see the language in Chinese. To fix this, simply right-click on the page and select Translate to English to change the language. Although this tool originally had a language barrier, it now supports English, so you should see it in English. Once the page is translated, go to the Image to Video section at the top. Upload your first image here, and then enter the prompt. For the prompt, we'll copy it from ChatGPT and paste it into the text box. After entering the prompt, click on Create to generate your video. Once we upload the first image, it will begin processing and converting into a video. While it's being processed, we can upload the second image and start its conversion as well. As we upload each image, make sure to paste the corresponding prompt for that specific image in the prompt section. The great thing about this tool is that we can convert up to three images into videos simultaneously. While one image is processing, we can upload the others. Once all the images are processed into videos, download each of them by clicking on Download next to the video. Save all the converted videos to your device. Repeat this process for all the images until every image is converted into a video. To generate the voiceover, we're going to use Play.ht, which is the best free text-to-speech tool. 
Start by clicking on Generate AI Voices for free. This will bring you to the sign-up page. You'll need to create an account here. I use a temp mail extension for this process to save time. It helps me quickly get a temporary email address. Copy and paste the email, use the same email as the password, and create any username. For the phone number, I go to a website that provides fakest numbers, grab one, and input it. Then click the sign up button. Now that our account is created, we can generate 12,000 characters from play.ht. Click on the voice actor name and choose the artist you want. Also, make sure to enable apply to all paragraphs once done. Click on the confirm button. Next, copy and paste the voiceover script into the box. Within five minutes, your movie's voiceover will be ready. I'll save the voiceover to my device for later use. Now, let's move to the video editing stage. You can use any video editor, but here I'm using CapCut Video Editor. After opening the editor, import all your videos and voiceovers into the project. Start by placing the voiceover on the timeline. Once the voiceover is in place, adjust all your videos along the timeline to sync with the voiceover according to your script. To make sure everything aligns perfectly, you can adjust the speed of the video. This allows you to make the video longer or shorter as needed to fit the voiceover timing. After syncing the voiceover with the video, feel free to add transitions and effects where necessary. Apply transitions and effects that enhance your video and match your vision. Once everything is set, you're done. You have your final video ready for export. After adjusting the video and voiceover, we move on to one of the most crucial parts that will give our movie the true cinematic feel adding background effects and music. To get the background music and sound effects, we'll go to the Pixabay website. Once there, click on the drop-down menu and select sound effects. Now, whatever type of sound effect or background music you need, just type it in the search bar. For example, if you type cinematic, you'll find sound effects and music related to cinematic themes. You can preview the sounds by clicking play. When you find the perfect sound effect or background music that suits your video, simply click download to save it. Download the required music and sound effects based on your video's theme and scene transitions. Once you've added these, your video will have the right atmosphere and vibe, making it feel like a professional movie. Now, head back to your video editor and import the background music and sound effects you downloaded. Apply the music and effects according to the mood of your scenes, adjusting the volume and timing as needed. Next, add a cinematic clip for the title screen of your movie. You can write the title of your movie on this clip. To hide any watermarks, you can place your channel's logo or the movie's title over the watermark, after adjusting everything to your liking, save your video project. Now, let's export the video. Choose the export settings based on your preference and save your final movie trailer in the desired format. And there you have it, friends. In the heart of the wilderness, she was alone, or so she thought. Lost in the rocks, she faces challenges beyond her imagination. But even in the darkest moments, there's a glimmer of hope. Her journey isn't over, but she's stronger than ever before. She found her way out, but she'll never be the same again. Through the struggle, she learned that survival is only half the journey. It's the strength to keep going that defines us. By following these steps, we've successfully created a movie trailer with consistent characters. I hope you found this method helpful. If you did, please give the video a like. By the way, I noticed in my analysis of Learnify AI that 95% of viewers haven't subscribed to the channel yet. So if you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing and pressing the bell icon to stay updated on all our future content. It really helps the channel grow. If you're curious about Top Filmmaker shares the best free AI tools for talking characters in short movies, click on the video on the left. If you're ready to explore, create an entire movie from scratch, step-by-step -step guide using free AI tools 2025 edition, click on the video on the right. Thank you for joining me on this journey. Happy Learnify AI. Goodbye.